a todos, ¿qué tal? Me encuentro acá por hablar con uno de mis eh, cantantes de, de la música pop, gótica favorita. Él ha estado en un montón de bandas, pero él es el cantante de The Metal Gurus. Oh, yeah, that... menos que Wayne Halsey. Wayne, how are you doing? I'm all right, thank you. And you? <laughs> so, are you a guru? I am a guru. For some. Yeah, yeah, same for some. Same only, only for some. Only for some. <laughs> so tell me, you are you are touring in Europe. You're coming to South America. Uh, tell me what is going on with the with the Cooper Band. Well, we played three shows in the UK just uh, um, uh, over the weekend, and um, we then we travelled to Paris yesterday. We had a night off in Paris, which I actually spent in bed because I've been a bit poorly. With the with the voice and the cold, I get a cold every tour. It's uh, one of those things. It's one of the uh, one of the things that comes with the job, I guess. Um, so today I won't know what the voice is like until I start singing and sound check, which is very very soon. Um, but uh, you know it, the shows were great. The shows were really good. The audiences were really great. They they helped me a lot. They sang along, which I like. Make note. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Learn the words because you can sing along. What people can expect from your your this tour with the show, especially here in, in Latin America? Um, well, we were there two years ago, which was a lot of fun. Um, we changed the set every night. We had like 50, 50 songs, more than 50 songs that we can choose from. So we, we like to change it every night. It, makes, it stops us being bored. And, um, and, you know, you don't always get to hear maybe the songs that you really want to hear, but we'll give you some of the songs that you want to hear. And we'll give you some of the songs we want to play. Anything outside Mission UK are you going to play? Any, any other thing from your other bands or just Mission? No, just Mission. I mean, we, we do a couple of cover versions, but none of my previous bands. Okay, okay, just, uh, just asking. And um, you know what? I uh, how was feeling to 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 cross the stressing uh, with the metal gurus? Uh, it was great. I mean, I mean, you know, wh when we were kids, that's that's the kind of first music we all listened to when we were kids. You know, and we grew up on the T Rex and David Bowie and Roxy Music and and things like that. You know, and um, and so obviously when we were in the position where we where we could do what we wanted. One of the things we did was form the Metal Gurus, and we went out and played a few shows. We dressed up, from, you know, in glam rock. We just did glam rock cover versions. It was great, great fun, great fun. And we got to record with um, Noddy and Jim from Slade as well. So that was a, a dream come true. Yeah, Slade, amazing band, you know. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's funny that you like so much the glam as, as I do, and, and you play more with, with the goth, you know, uh, 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 yeah, I mean, I, yeah, I don't necessarily agree with that, but I, I, I don't also, I also look skewy. I mean, I don't really care what how people perceive us, you know, but for me, I think we're more of a 70s rock band with a little bit of 80s in it, a little bit of 90s in it, a little bit of today in it, you know, I mean, but I think essentially we are as some of our um, influences, which we're, and as we said before, we were raised on glam rock, and then we were raised on, you know, we from glam rock we went to things like Led Zeppelin and, uh, you know, things like that, um, Deep Purple and uh, Black Sabbath. Not that we sound like them particularly, maybe a bit of Led Zeppelin, and then punk came along, and then we, you know, we got a bit of punk in us too. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, well, like we got the en energy of punk in us. Um, yeah, no, I mean we are a sum of we are, we are the sum of our influences, like like every band. Right, but you, I know, I know you live in Sao Paulo, right? I well, I I have an apartment in Sao Paulo, but I live in the countryside, about two and a half hours inland from Sao Paulo. Okay, how yeah. how's life in in in, in Brazil? Você fala português? É pouco pouquinho. Pouquinho. Mais pouquinho. Eh, I I love it. I mean, I've been there for twenty two years now, so um, to me, it's home. It's the longest I've lived anywhere in the whole of my life. You know, I'm 66 years old now, so that's uh, 22 years is a third of my life I've lived there. So. Oh my gosh, I didn't know. Uh, so you are close to to Argentina, so you can come anytime. 
I do. I love Argentina. Well, I love Bu- Buenos Aires particularly. I mean, that that's that's a, probably mine and my wife's favorite South American city. And we we have been there on holidays several times. We have friends there, and so we have been to Buenos Aires a few times. You know, without having to play. I love Buenos Aires. Really? It's got a real, real, real good spirit to it. I think. Have you ever gone to Mar del Plata? I am. I'm right now in Mar del Plata. No. We're gonna take you here. <laughs> Look, uh, if I mention Spain, what it comes to my mind? Because I know you're gonna play right now. I mean, in in, in tomorrow. Yeah, right? I mean, like I said, we're in Paris today. We're in Toulouse tomorrow. Then in Barcelona on Wednesday. Madrid, Thursday, then we're playing Murcia Visor Festival on Friday, and we have a couple of shows in Portugal, uh, uh, Lisbon and Porto, and then we finish in Bilbao uh, next week, next next Tuesday. Good, good. Then you come, I'm sorry, say again? And then we come to South America, yeah. Yeah, do you have the date for? And work our way up South America to Mexico and Costa Rica. Good. Do you have the date, or or I put I'm gonna put it on. So well, I mean, I, I don't have them off. Of, I I can tell you, Rio is the eleventh. Yeah. Of October. Santa Santo Andre, which is part of San Paulo, is the twelfth. Saturday the twelfth. San Paulo is Sunday the thirteenth. Uh, Curitiba is Tuesday the fifteenth. Buenos Aires is Thursday the 17th. 17th, yeah. I know that. Santiago, Chile is Saturday the 19th. Uh, Bogota, uh, Colombia is Monday the... We are, I don't know what the date is, but it's the Monday after um, Santiago. And then on the Wednesday, it's Mexico City. And then on the Friday, it's um, San, Ho- San Jose in Costa Rica. Pura vida, Costa Rica. Very good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been to Costa Rica a couple of times before, but only on holiday. You, you speak some Spanish or, or just no. one? Huh? Well, only, only, only the words that are the same in Portuguese. <laughs> Very, actually, I, I'm, I'm learning Portuguese as we speak. You know, guys, I love that. They tend to, you know, Brazil is, is amazing. You know. Yeah, it's a big country. It's got a got. I mean, it's got ma- massive amount of uh, natural resources, um, and I, I love the people as well. The people are, are very. I mean, it's very difficult to get things done there on time. You know, it's like you know, if they don't have to do it today, then do it tomorrow. If they don't have to do it tomorrow, then don't bother doing it. It's a very much that kind of attitude, which is a good attitude, I suppose, to have in life. But um, it's. It's difficult when you want to get things done. Uh, I agree. I I experienced the same in Argentina. Believe me. Yeah, I think it's I think it's a Latin America thing actually. Yeah, very very relaxed and <laughs> very relaxed. sometimes has to be more British style, you know. Well, more, more I don't know about that. It, I mean, you know, the British style. It, it, you know, it's uh, you, you got to get your priorities right. You got to get the right balance. You know. Uh-huh. Life is for living. It's not just for working. Yeah, it's, it's also for fun, and family, yeah. and friends, and stuff like that. Who's in the band? Craig, Craig, Adam on bass, Simon Hinkler on guitar, and Alex Bomb is playing the drums. Alex Bomb. He's, yeah. he's yeah. a young boy. He's a young. Again? He's a young boy. Huh? He is. I, I'm old. I'm old enough to be his granddad. Uh, ah, <laughs> last. Last question. I know you are you are in rest. Um, Nick Brown. Nick Brown. Um, he hasn't played drums for a long, long time, unfortunately. Uh, he li- still lives in Leeds. He, he does does his thing. Okay. Um, if he has other work to do. Okay. But he's not involved in music. I I, I knew it, but the, I gotta ask. You know, because because every okay. role is every uh, fan in in mission wonders sometimes. You know, hey, Nick, come back. You know. Mm. Yeah, I know. I mean, in, in um, 2026 is our 40th anniversary. Unbelievable. Wow. Unbelievable. Wow. I know. Yeah, I know. Okay, don't hang up. We're going to do a couple of TV spots. Uh, when? 
thank you thank you for your time okay, okay. appreciate it all right